G'day guys, Jake here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to join Azure Active Directory. And what Azure Active Directory is, is it's sort of like Active Directory that you'd have on a normal server, except it's in the cloud. So it manages users and allows you to tap into different things. But basically, like if you have Office 365, you'll have Azure Active Directory and Azure Active Directory is a free service provided by Microsoft and all you'll need to do if you don't have Office 365 and you wanted to use it you can actually just create an Azure account and then make an Active Directory thing in there for it. So anyway I'll digress and actually show you how to do it. So what you'll need to do is hit the start button and go to settings then you'll want to go to system then you'll want to go to about and then you'll see under the organization is work group. But what you want to do is join Azure AD. So hit that. So this will happen, most of the people that would be doing this will have an Office 365 account. But um, before you do actually join, be sure to note that this will give control to who, of your computer to whoever has control of the Azure Active Directory instance. So if you do not want the administrator to have control of your computer, don't join Azure AD. So anyway, I'll continue. Hit continue. Then you'll need to type in your email address and password for your email or for your Azure Active Directory account. I'm using email because I have Office 365 email. Then hit sign in. And it'll think for a bit and then it'll give you this confirmation thing. You're connecting to this instance. Your username is such and such and your user type is such and such. Then hit join. Then while you're waiting, it'll apply the policy, hit finish, and here you'll see an organization instead of being a work group. So that was how to connect to Azure Active Directory with Windows 10. Be sure to like and subscribe and share this video to anyone you want to. Thank you, and I'll see you later.